Jamal, man, this beat is crazy. Some power, but 
and it just needs to pull everything together and uh, yeah it was great to get him involved with the academy and uh, pull him through into the team. Oh, he's uh, the car of the sport in South Africa. He's been there for so long, and oh, if you ride with him, I uh, saw at Mahuba, he doesn't look back. So, yeah, it's quite sketchy, but I think he knows who's there. But yeah, he just rides. <laughs> Yeah, and uh, Makhuba is of Nierach. Yeah, I think uh, with the team, you know, going forward into the next year, it was important for us to, you know, get some depth in in, in our riders. And uh, yeah, adding Peter as a youngster, you know, uh, ensures that we uh, are looking forward into the future. And, uh, you know, our sponsors are involved long term, so. You know, we know we're not all going to be riding bikes forever, so uh, it's just a great way to look further into the future and uh, put something back into the sport. Riding to Peter Fuller, what does that mean to you? What does that mean to you? It was a great opportunity for me just to ride with him and yeah, the, the team asked me to ride with him was awesome and yeah, to have a victory with Philip, uh, it was so awesome and yeah, I think it uh, was very good for me. Yes, yes, I think uh, Cape Epic is, yeah, to do it is one of the best races to prepare for any stage race because it's so big and yeah, it, you, you learn a lot and see a lot throughout stage racing, so I was for sure prepared for a stage race. And um, no, it's no, for the team to pull me in uh, was so nice, and it wasn't like I was actually a academy rider for them, it was like I was actually part of the team, just another kid. So yeah, it was so nice of them, yeah, they helped me a lot. Yes, I think the main, one of the main goals of this Makuba race is uh, obviously preparation going uh, to World Champs in Switzerland. Uh, the timing is, is perfect for that and it's a hard route with quite a lot of climbing and uh, that's exactly what we'll get at, uh, at World Champs in Switzerland. So uh, the goal is to race hard and uh, you know, get that uh, proper riding in and I'm sure with uh, you know our current shape and uh, racing hard, we will uh, hopefully get a win along along the way. Okay. Um. <coughs> cool. Yeah. So, what did you carry into this race? Oh, I don't know what I would carry into this race. Uh, probably some goose and some balls in my back, but. <laughs> 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 uh, <laughs> not for a small fella. <laughs> no, um, yeah, I think uh, I have learned a lot more and uh, how to do racing every time it's something new. But uh, yeah, this year I'm just gonna see if I can go as hard as I can because it's training for Philip for world champs and uh, I don't want to keep him back so. <laughs> That's my, my main motivation. And then Philip, for you, um, what would you carry into this race? <laughs> <laughs> I'll carry some extra gels for Peter. <laughs> no, I'm sure Peter will carry, carry enough gels for both of us. So, um, no, I think uh, we just carry uh, yeah, an advantage going into this race because we've done it before and uh, we know the route. and. Uh, I think it's pretty much the same, so I think uh, yeah, against some of the other competitors that didn't race last year, we've got a slight advantage, you know, having been there last year. Yeah, so uh, yeah, it's a short race stage, stage, uh, 
<laughs> yeah, it's uh, short stages, so I won't take so much. I think the longest one is 80k or something. But um, yeah, a few bars, few gels, uh, multi tool and CO2 and uh, plugs to seal the tires. And yeah, now that we have the ACs, I will take a fully charged battery as well. And uh, oh, try to take strong legs with the driver filler.